Hey, here's our old drag strip. This was the end of Neves Road in the Pit Polder and Pit Meadows, British Columbia, Canada. And here this road goes straight for way over half a mile. I'm sorry about the uh, rifle fire in the background, shotgun fire, whatever, but uh, it's berry season, they're scaring away the birds. Uh, anyway, here's the end of the road, straight road. Used to be in better condition, but there you can see the last uh, electricity pole and there's no more electricity beyond there. So this was the uh, wilderness, the end of nowhere with the uh, gunfire in the background. Very nice. Okay. Anyway, this road was our drag strip. Every Friday night after dark, hundreds of people would come down here usually and uh, they would drag. Uh, there was no cars out here otherwise so that people could race their quarter mile and get timed and race against each other one on each side of the road and uh, I can't remember any accidents happening and I don't believe the police ever came down here uh, they didn't used to patrol down here because there wasn't anything uh, to patrol so anyway this was our uh, local drag strip uh, the only one I know about, the only one I went to, I had a Viva Vauxhall which had a maximum like 50 miles an hour and a quarter mile in 3.4 minutes, not seconds, minutes. So uh, I never actually raced in it, but I enjoyed watching the races and socializing, meeting people and uh, obviously a lot of people uh, had imbibing uh, beverages down here uh, as the police stayed away there was nobody to uh, stop them so anyway uh, I just wanted to tell you this was our local hangout for all the uh, teenagers in the area at the time could come down here and again I remember hundreds of people every Friday night usually uh, enjoying the amateur drag racing. Okay, so here it is. The end of Neves Road, off of the map at the time. Uh, as you can see, there's no one around, even uh, today. <laughs> and it's surrounded by farmland dikes. This used to be all just swamp and slough and bog, but now uh, some of it has been turned to farmland. Okay, thank you. I hope you enjoyed this discussion. Dr. Ordog, over and out.